All right, this is Ty with Green Regiment. Welcome to Ty's Front Seat Chronicle. No, I'm just kidding. No, I figured maybe this is a another avenue for me to get out some information to you quickly. I'm on my way to the gym, but there's a lot of questions that are being asked about the 100% plant-based challenge starting in January. So I figure, why not? Usually, normally when I'm on my way to the gym, I listen to some music, but I think this would be a great way for me to get our information to you. Uh, quickly anything that's on my mind. I can just talk to you about it. So let's get started So I'm getting questions about the type of menu that will be used for January and I'm not going to provide one set menu because I truly believe that first of all all of us are not gonna like Whatever it is that would be put on that menu secondly that just gives a lot of us an excuse as to not do the challenge because you'll find items on the menu that you just don't like but what i am going to do for you is i'm supplying you with a lot of various options that's why i'm starting to do this today's like december 7th or 8th um so crazy these days i don't even know what the date is but i'm starting this early so i'm giving you this information early i want you to plan ahead of time i don't want january 1st to happen to just show up all of a sudden and now here we go we're on the challenge that's not going to work so we're planning ahead of time i'm doing I'm taking the extra effort to get out there and, and see what plant-based options that are out there for us. So when January 1st hits, we're ready to go. I'm already eating some of this food, so I'll have some videos for you, get, giving you some reviews. But make sure that you do your part. You have to watch these videos that I'm creating. You can go to our highlights on our Instagram. So if you happen to miss any of the stories that I released, all of these stories would be can easily be replayed right there on the highlights. The, the title of the highlights is 2020 Challenge. So you can easily find all of those videos. So um, let me just, you know, clarify that for you. In the videos, I will repeat myself because if you think about it, think about television commercials, the first time you see a commercial, you're probably not going to buy whatever product or item that they're advertising to you. But if you keep seeing it, you end up buying it. And that's the entire thing that I want you to think about with this challenge is I'm going to repeat certain things that I know eventually will stick with you and it will make this entire challenge much easier for you. So we're clear on that. Also, in terms of this challenge, I already, already released a video on your reason as to why you don't want to do this challenge. I told you my reason why. I'll continue to tell you my reasons why that I'm doing this. But... When you're telling other people about this challenge, because I myself am telling everyone that I know about the challenge, and I have some friends who I've known for years, and they don't want to have anything to do with the challenge. But I laugh, because I don't care. I'm going to do the challenge regardless if they do the challenge or not. And that's the type of attitude that I want you to have. You know, when you're looking to do something great and positive for yourself, some people just won't be along that journey with you. And the way I look at it, it's okay. Who cares? Because if it's something positive that you want to do, just go ahead and do it. You don't want to wait around for, for people to join you. You don't want to wait around for people's acceptance because we don't need that. Uh, if I waited around for people's acceptance on me going to the gym and me eating right, that would never happen. You know, Because people have their own agendas and sometimes people do mean well, but a lot of times we appeal to unqualified authority. You know, we'll ask a relative or a friend, you know, what do they think about this diet? Or what do they think about this, this workout? But they've never done it. So why in the world would we ask them, someone who's unqualified? I mean, our car breaks down. We don't go to a heart surgeon for that. We go to our mechanic and vice versa. So you, you get what I'm saying. So just keep that in mind. I'll reiterate that, you know, again in the future. But just want to make a quick video for you. So you got that. I'm looking at the time. It's really not that quick. You know, I don't want to rattle on too much. But you know, tell me what you think about this style of video. If you don't like it, uh, tell me that you don't like it. If you do like it, you want me to make more of them, then I'll do that. Because, like I said, I think this is a great way for me to get information out to you as quickly as possible. All right, there you go. You know where to find us, at Green Regimen. And we'll see you soon.